So I'm here with head coach Mark and captain Shep um, after a thrilling uh, win over Oxford. Um, Shep, it's your first game back um, in well playing yeah. playing back after the ban in Cardiff. Uh, how do you feel? It was tough in the stands for that 13 game ban or whatever I had to uh, stand. But you know, I've been supporting the boys all the way through, and what a great first game home game back. Boys battled so hard, and it was great to get that 3-2 win. Uh, would you say that you made the difference, or is it? Oh, no, of course not. We're a full <laughs> team. Yeah, we battle together, we win together, we lose together. Um, it was quite a gripping game, um, you know, coming from behind in the last period, scoring those two quick goals, getting ahead. Um, what changed in that second um, break to get the boys going? Uh, well, I think it was just a case of we stopped taking penalties. Um, we took a load of penalties in the second period, and I think that affected us. But um, third period, after we killed off the um, the five of match, I think we just went to work and just broke them down. We didn't change anything system wise. Yeah, well, sometimes you don't need to. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, so, in terms of like the team and the way it works, like Shep, what's your what's your favourite part about captain in this team in particular? It's such a young team, but all the boys have got their heads screwed on. They buy into the systems. A lot of the boys, this is their first or maybe second year of uh, senior hockey, and you wouldn't tell. They play so with such a mature head on their shoulders. It's great to be the captain of that locker room. And, and Mark, how about coaching kind of the, the young guys coming out of juniors? And... Oh, it's great because they, they're like sponges, you know, they soak up every little bit of information um, and it's nice to see them develop and it, one of my favourite years, to be honest. It's, uh, it's been such a good dressing room. Uh, everyone's buying into it and um, the, the closeness of the group uh, is probably one of our strengths. They've really, really come together and, and they work hard together. And as Alice said, they win, lose, draw as a team. Um, and yeah, we don't we don't over celebrate the wins, and we don't uh, we don't get too upset with the losses. Uh, we're building, we're developing, and we know that was coming. So just in terms of you know when we began the season, I think a lot of other teams thought that we wouldn't even get a win this season. Mm. Um, what? How much did that mean to the to the guys in the locker room when we actually started getting those wins and getting those points? Oh, a huge amount. I think. Um, we had a number of games that were quite close and a couple of games that we, we felt that we could have won or they could have been a lot closer and obviously some games that we know that we're going to um, we're going to struggle with teams like Stratton all their experience and I think that's the the difference you know it's, it's their their experience against ours you know they're relatively new into the league into senior hockey um, so we knew the wins were going to come to be honest even though that uh, Maybe some people might not have felt like that, but I think in the room we all knew it was coming and um, that's our sixth win now of the season. So not bad for a team that would never win a game.